Today on MTG Unpacked, we're getting stuck into a brand new Dominaria United Jumpstart Booster Box. So you shuffle up two packs from here and you can put a deck together. So there's a bit about that. There's themes like Mystic Mischief and Totally Ruthless. But before we get into that, I wanted to highlight the 30th anniversary promos. So you can pick these up at your local game store. So we have Ball Lightning. And I like the 30 flashing there on the text area. We got Findelhorn Elfen, which is a German version of the elves, and Sarah Angel. So I think that stuff looks absolutely fantastic. So definitely pop down your local game store, pick up some of those. Okay, I think you do have to purchase something though to get those. So we've got 18 packs in here. This is specifically for Dominaria United. Mix and match to defend Dominaria. Okay, so you're looking for about 80 to 90 bucks US for these. So let's get into it. And there is actually a Jumpstart coming uh, in December. So Jumpstart 2022, completely different product. Uh, this one apparently has about 10 different themes, so we'll see how many we can find today. We've got Coalition Legion, Samite Herbalist, Banalish Faithbonder, Knight of Dawn's Light, Argivian Cavalier, Chas Charismatic Vanguard, Griffin Protector, Take Up the Shield, Prayer of Binding, Joined Forces, Love Song of Night and Day, and the rare is Sarah Redeemer, and we should get another one here, Defiler of Faith. And a planes. So a couple of... Okay, so you're getting a bunch of different lands here. And a very nice uh, stained glass. And a foil version. And another one. Right, so you get two foils. So the idea is you just jam the uh, cards together to form a deck. These are actually the replacements for the theme boosters. So that's the uh, terrible product you might have seen. Uh, basically the same sort of idea, but uh, without the Jumpstart branding and not as many themes. They've got Monster Territory for another theme here. Floriferous Vine Wall, Sunbathing Root Waller, Neshoba Brawler, The Weather Seed Treaty, Magnagoth Sentry Territorial Marrow, Yavamaya Sojourner, Gaia's Might, Slimefoot Survey, Bite Down. And the rare is Kurian Beast Cooler, Briar Hydra, and we don't need to go through... Oh, you got a Radiant Grove. Okay, Wooded Ridgeline. Uh, Haunted Mire. Tangled Islet. And a Foil. Yeah, so the Foil's at the end. Okay, so two unique themes so far. Can we find them all? I'm hoping this box will be able to get all the themes. Ready to charge. Okay, so this must be like a mono red type deal. Electrostatic Infantry, Yavamaya Steel Crusher, Balduvian Berserker, Dragon Whelp, Coalition Warbrute, Molten Monstrosity, Flowstone Infusion, Twin Ferno, Jaya's Fionado, Furious Bellow, and Squee Dubious Monarch. Nice! And Ragefire Hellkite for the second rare. So we got a nice mountain here. And some foils at the back. Okay, so I do expect there's going to be a bit of randomness here. So if you get the same themes as I do, you're not necessarily going to get the exact same cards. But the decks will be pretty similar, I imagine. Okay, totally merciless. So I'm expecting a bunch of Phyrexians here. We've got Knight of Dusk Shadow, Phyrexian Vivisector, Eerie Soul Tender. Phyrexian Rager, Singir Connoisseur, Writhing Necromass, Battle Rage Blessing, Pilfer, Braids' Frightful Return, Extinguish the Light, and a Mythic Weatherlight completed. Awesome. And Tyrannical Pit Lord, and a bunch of basics, and you do get some of the showcase arts at least, so that's cool. A couple of foils there. I don't know, no foil showcase art in these? Interesting choice. Okay, so four unique themes so far. Beast Territory. 
Okay, so that's the basking root waller there. Floriferous vine wall, sunbathing root waller. Okay, that's what he is, sunbathing. Deathbloom gardener, Magnagoth sentry, territorial marrow, linebreaker, bayloth, mossbeard, ancient, bite down, broken wings, sign foot survey, and Lanawar green widow, along with briar hydra. And okay, you do get a stained glass, wooded ridgeline, radiant grove, haunted mire, tangled islet, and some foils. Okay, so five themes. I'm guessing then that means we have half of the themes possible. Okay, Arcane Mischief. Another unique one here. We've got Haunting Figment, Soaring Drake, Academy Wall. Talus Lookout, Frostfist Strider, Jin of the Fountain, Impulse, Shore Up, Combat Research, Impede Momentum, and a Mythic Sphinx of Clear Skies. Awesome. And Cosmic Epiphany. And then we have our basics here, just some islands and foils at the end. Okay, so that was a nice one. Got a Mythic out of the deal. So we're a third of the way through here. Six unique themes so far. Mystic Mischief. Okay, this is another different one. Coral Colony, Soaring Drake, Academy Wall, Talus Lookout, Talarian Terror, Frostfist Strider, Impulse, Impede Momentum, Urtai's Scorn, Founding the Third Path. That's actually a decent one. And a Mythic Vesuvan Duplomancy. Nice. And Cosmic Epiphany, and then our basics here, we've got our showcase. So I'm uh, not quite sure, they, I think they're a little bit better than the theme boosters so far. At least the sort of pulls we're getting here, so we've got a couple of mythics so far. Coalition Core, okay that's another new one. We've got Clockwork, Drawbridge, Resolute Reinforcements, I give in Cavalier. Charismatic Vanguard, Captain's Call, Griffin Protector, Argivian Phalanx, Prayer of Binding, Join Forces, Love Song of Night and Day, and Sarah Redeemer, along with Valiant Veteran. Okay, so a lot of different colour choices here. You could make some good two colour decks. Okay, so eight unique themes. Is it just going to continue on like this until we start repeating? I don't know. Okay, Monster Territory. So we saw that one earlier. So let's just zip through here. Did we get anything? This all looks pretty similar. Oh, okay, yeah, this is different. So we've got Defiler of Vigor is the rare, along with Briar Hydra. And any difference here? Radiant Grove, Ridgeline, Haunted Mire, Tangled Islet. Okay. So you do get some variety at least. I assume that carries across to the commons and uncommons. So we have two monster territory. I want to keep track to see can we get one of each theme. It's probably now we're going to start repeating. Ready to attack. Okay, this one's a unique one. Phoenix Chick, Electrostatic Infantry, Goblin Picker. Love the goblins. Flowstone Kavu. Dragon Whelp, Coalition Warbrute, Hammerhand, Lightning Strike, Jaya's Fire Nado, Twin Inferno, and Defiler of Instinct for the rare, along with Rage Fire Hellkite. Okay, so you're noticing a bunch of similarities with the other red deck, although they have mixed up the cards here. So we've got like nine unique themes. Can we make a 10th Coalition Legion? Okay, so we'll skip ahead here until we get to... Here we go. So the rares, we have Sarah Redeemer. I think we got that one last time. And Anointed Peacekeeper. And I'm guessing, yeah, land's looking pretty similar. Yep, okay, so two of those. And we are now two-thirds of the way through. We're just looking for that last theme, whatever it is. 
What could it be? Totally ruthless. Okay, here it is. <clears throat> so you got Cult, Conscript, Phyrexian Vivisector, Splatter Goblin, Phyrexian Rager, Gibbering Barricade, Senge Connoisseur, Bone Splinters, Cut Down, that's a decent pull, Battle Rage Blessing, Braids' Frightful Return, Defiler of Flesh for the rare and tyrannical Pit Lord. And let's see if we get anything interesting here. Same old stuff. Okay. So what is that? We got the... I think it was three Mythics, unless I'm miscounting. So I'm assuming we'll probably get maybe two more Mythics here. If the balance is the same. Okay, Mystic Mischief. So we saw that one earlier. Let's just zip through here until founding the third path that's good and the rare here we have ether channeler so i don't remember that one from before and cosmic epiphany yep so we got that one and a lands nice that you get a couple of foils that's not something i remember uh from the theme boosters okay so on the home stretch here have you opened any of these? How did you do with the Mythic Pools? Let me know. Coalition Legion. And again, let's zip through to the rare. You'll be able to see... Oh, okay. A Mythic Sarah Paragon. That is pretty tasty. Sarah Redeemer as well. Nice angel deck. Uh, the fun thing with these is if they've got like a named theme... Uh, I would put them in um, sleeves and you could have like a battle box type thing where you just pick two decks and then uh, battle them against your opponents. So we've got a Beast Territory. So this one we've already got. So it is looking like precisely 10 different themes. We've got Lanawar, Loam Speaker for the rare. Another one, Briar Hydra. And I don't remember getting, typically you would only get one rare or mythic out of the theme boosters. So that's some improvement at least. Where's the beast territory? Over here. So we are down to three packs. This is actually looking better than I thought. We have ready to charge. And yeah, we've got that one as well. So we will go through here. Until we find our rare. So we have the Elder Dragon War. Ragefire Hellkite. And a bunch of basic goodness here. Yeah, so I think these are a step above the theme boosters. Which I always thought were a terrible product. Um, but I'm a little bit disappointed. There's only uh, 10 themes. And it seems like there aren't any unique cards. Does anyone know if they've got any special ones here? Leave a note in the comments. So we've got Totally Merciless. And let's get through it to... Oh, nice! Mythic Shieldred the Apocalypse. Fantastic. And Tyrannical Pit Lord. Okay, so the Mythic rate is pretty much what I was expecting. Like, maybe like 5 or 6 her box. Okay, totally merciless is up here. We have one more pack to crack. Let me know what you think in the comments on uh, this product. Do you think it's better than the theme boosters? I'm curious how many people think so. So we've got Arcane Mischief and let's see if we can get another mythic to close here. So we have Defiler of Dreams is the rare. What else? Cosmic Epiphany. Okay, we've seen that in a bunch of these so far. Yeah, so that is actually not too shabby. So I think getting a box of these is the way to go. Arcane Mischief. Yeah, so ready-made deck battles here. I think it's a decent product. Not quite as good as Jumpstart 2022, I expect, will be, which should have a lot more themes. Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.